So today we're planting out a couple of things. As you can see earlier, I showed the picture of where I am planting my flat Dutch cabbage is gonna be in that area. I got some sugar beets from GT Junior in Alaska that are gonna be planted over there. I got some Swiss chard from GT Junior that's gonna be planted there. I have some onions that um, I grew from seed that we're gonna plant here. And then here is my garlic from Botanical Interest that's going to go here. Um, right now I'm amending the beds and then I'm going to get planted. This year I am planting soft neck red garlic. All of the garlics I'm planting, I'm pretty sure are soft neck. We have the Sicilian artichoke and then we have the hard neck spanish roja and then i have some elephant garlic that i just bought from the grocery store but we're going to split them up and we're going to plant them all in here and my onions will go in there and then whatever area that i have left over i will put some more garlic so Let's get seed dropping, guys. So, guys, we have our three different types of garlic. We have our enchilium <laughs> red that's in this area. And all you literally do is you take the garlic this end down and you press it into the soil. That's all you have to do. You press it into your soil. As easy as that, you take this in and you press it into your soil. And so remember, I do have three types of garlic and you don't even have to worry about the outer shell that's flying all over the place. That's not a big deal. But in this area, we have the Sicilian artichoke. In this area, we have the Enchilium red. And in this area, we have our Spanish Roja. And guys, it's as simple as that. And I'm just gonna brush the soil over. Over there, I already have my onions put down. I'm gonna put my drip hose back. And let everything get watered in and the white stuff you see that is actually diatomaceous earth i saw quite a few ants out and i don't want them to eat the roots of the onions so i just went ahead and sprinkled it down and i'll come back out tomorrow and sprinkle it down again so remember as always guys get up get out and grow something and have faith in our food. We'll see you the next time.